it be like what it be like like you already know what it is it's your boy Calvin like my way hey today just want to drop this quick video because there's this notion that, that slavery right uh, is only you know it, it's something that happened a long time ago and that there's no valid and conversating it now see what we got to realize is slavery never ever ever stopped uh, there was slavery going on uh, in the 80s 60s and we're talking about 19s there's slavery still going on now uh, currently overseas and we're actually still living in slavery in the United States now okay you know I might, might be saying how in the heck you know uh, emancipation proclamation all that right civil war all that yo we still living in slavery the only thing different now is we are all in slavery when I say we're all in slavery, I mean black people, white people, Mexican people, everybody. And see, this is the thing we are being controlled. It's like, like if you think about social media right now, uh, Facebook, YouTube, uh, Facebook, for example. Something happens. Facebook makes a change. Say, oh, to show your support for X, Y, Z, change your profile picture to this. And then everybody and their mama flip and change automatically crazy uh, stuff comes across your news feed and that's the biggest news of the day that's the only thing on your mind that's on everybody's mind is the same deal mass media the same way whatever they put in front of you that becomes your news that becomes your your focus that becomes your truth that becomes your 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 identity realistically whatever is important even if it's bull crap that you know is fake we're talking about television uh tv shows from from um um what what's the show uh from walking dead the game of thrones to uh freaking uh i can't even think of that little hip-hop show they got but anyway, they got all these freaking shows and then let's say a Wednesday night or a Sunday night or whatever, people just locked in, locked on their television set to do this. Same thing with uh, Black Friday, Christmas and all this crap. Everybody gets up out of their 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 their, their hard earned money. They run out to the grocery not the grocery stores, but to the, the Walmarts, the sales, the malls, the shopping centers to spend all their freaking money on freaking TVs, electronics, and BS. And BS. And see, the thing is, we're doing this and it's not even of our own will. And every one of you guys are probably sitting here saying, no, this is, you know, this is what I want to do. This is what I believe in. This, No, it's not. It's total bull crap. The truth is the only reason you even have an opinion about the political system for the most part, the most of you cats, is only because somebody else gave you that opinion first. The only reason that you're a Democrat is because somebody else told you about being a Democrat. Your parents fed that into your head. The only reason a lot of you cats is Republican because the same crap. You're freaking slaves. You're working jobs for people that are running your life. You, 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 you're, you're going on this hustle and bustle, robbing Peter to pay Paul all this nonsense and you don't even know why I'm telling you why you are a slave and it sucks it's real it's not a black thing it's not a white thing this is a people thing our government has enslaved every single one of you let me show you how let me tell you okay uh, freedom right independence we just 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 a couple days ago we did the uh, 4th of July celebration of independence why did the United States break away from British rule why did we say we were getting the hell up out of there we want to be our own country because of a one cent tax a one freaking cent tax now how many of you are employees you work a 9 to 5 job that means you work hours you get paid dollars now you're getting taxed on every single thing that you make it's called federal income tax right now you're working not a one cent tax you are getting taxed up to 40 to 60 percent on all your income for what for liberty and freedom for 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 benefits 
Hell no. Nah. You're getting taxed because master said you're going to give me part of what you made. That's what, that's what it really is. You can keep a little bit of what you pick. You're still a slave. Get out of this bull crap mindset. Every single one of you in the United States of these Americas are a slave. You're a black slave, you're a white slave, you're a rich slave, you're a poor slave, you're still a slave. The only way you're going to get out of this thing is for the people to unite together and change the system. I don't care who you vote in, it's going to be the same system. Get out of the matrix. We got to unplug. We got to change our mindset. We got to start reading again. People are too dumb. They doped up on fluoride. They don't have no fight in their body. They're eating this all this crapped up food. And they're stupid. You're stupid. You know, I'm, I'm just, I'm sorry. But I ain't sorry. You're stupid. If you're happy in the situation with the mindset, with this ideal of false flag freedom and and Think about it. Before the Atlantic shooting, everybody was crying about, oh, my God, we're scared of gay people in the bathrooms. Are we scared of people going to be in there hurting kids? And that's a freaking problem. Next week, boom. Oh, my God. Muhammad Ali died. Everybody talking about how great of a person he was. Great, great man. This and that. The third. Awesome Muslim man. You know, great faith. Atlanta happened. Everybody's scared of Muslim. Everybody loved gay folks. What the hell happened? It's a, it's, I'm telling you, not saying that you should hate anybody based off their religion or their sexual orientation. That's their business. The only problem I have is when whoever it is, I don't care what you do. I don't care where you stand and whatever you got. I don't really care. The problem that I have is when you try to force your view on me. That's just like me. I'm a believer. I believe in the scripture. I'm not going to force my belief on you. This is what I believe. This is where I stand. But at the end of the day, at the end of the day, I can't force you to believe in anything. And neither can you. You can't force me to accept your lifestyle. I could care less about your lifestyle. You're not going to force it on me. Now, when the Atlanta shoot happened, it jumped on TV. Everybody was against Muslims. Everybody was for the, for the uh, alternative lifestyles, I say. That's the problem. The media has you brainwashed. You don't know what you believe in. You have no foundation. You have no backbone. You are broken people. You, you, you sissified. Every single one of you men, you punks. You don't know what you believe in. You don't know what you stand for. You don't, you don't even know what the hell you believe in for your kids. Stand the hell up. Stop being pussified slaves. Be men. All right? And you women, stop being, trying to be the man and support your man. And if a man ain't in the picture, then you stand the heck up. Hell, stand up beside your man. But the problem is, everything is out of whack. Stop being slaves. Stop getting sucked into this jacked up system. They got you believing bull crap. Get out the matrix. It's time to unplug. It's time for us as people to stand up, take our country back. You know, what's that? As far as black folks just want our country to know, it's time for us to take control. Okay? <laughs> it's time for everybody. If you're tired of being slaves, it's time for you to stand the hell up. Let your voice be heard. It's time to organize. It's time for folks to if, right to bear arms. Everybody need to have something. Everybody need to bear arms. Everybody needs to be prepared. Because at the end of the day, if you ain't prepared, they're taking and they're ruling you with an iron fist. And that's the truth. And that's the truth just like that. Till next time. Be blessed. Stay prayed up. But don't pray and then don't do nothing. That's just real talk. Stop being slaves. It's time to stand up. Get on some Nat Turner type stuff. Till next time. Chill.